mycket rika pengar. When he was 14, he started drinking the coffees. En framtida stjärna Hallen. I can't believe you've done this. Här är gud. I know we've already announced that we hit a million subscribers on the YouTube channel, but YouTube uh, sent over the one million subscriber plaque. As you guys can see here, uh, we're showing the reflection of the squad that we're going to be using in it, and it looks really, really cool, guys. So I just want to say thank you again. Uh, again, this is, yeah, this is the plaque you get for, for hitting a million subscribers. It looks pretty damn cool. Looks like it's made of wood and some metal. It says, presented to Zwayback HD, aka us, uh, for passing one million subscribers, and it has the cool little play button in the middle, and then also is, uh, reflective, so I can use this as a mirror. But, what's happening, boys, and welcome to the 92-rated Future Stars Erling Braut Halland Episodia. I know some of you guys probably thought that this one wasn't coming just because he's so expensive. 2.6 million coins is what I spent for him. That's actually discounted. Uh, that was the cheapest on the market. There was another one for 2.7, so we got him for like about 100,000 coins cheaper. Um, you guys know we've loved every iteration of his card so far, and uh, even his 86 inform was something that did bits for us, and then now uh, he obviously gets himself a Future Stars card. Didn't know if he was going to get one because he was technically, or he's technically a star that's already arrived. He's been doing bits for Dortmund in the Bundesliga. The last, uh, the last game was the only one where he hasn't scored uh, since playing for Dortmund, uh, and that was a nuts, nuts match versus uh, versus Leverkusen. So it was the Kai Holland, uh, the Kai Holland match. So it was very, very interesting to see. But um, today we're going to look at this card. We're going to see if there's any way possible, and I can pretty much already guarantee you that. 2.6 million coins for a card is just like it's nuts. It has to do such crazy bits in it for in order to in order for it to be worth it. Uh, and I, I can already tell you that there's some pretty wild stats on this card. Six four high medium. I know the three star three star, but you guys know going back to last year with uh, with Poulsen's card uh, for Leipzig, we've uh, we've not shied away from players that are three star three star. Speaking of, there is an objectives uh, uh, Nicolo Zaniolo who we're going to be grinding on stream to, uh, stream tonight. We're going to do uh, we're going to play as long as it takes to unlock him, and then tomorrow's uh, episode will be the uh, Nicolo Zaniolo objective uh, player's way of view. But like I always say, boys, if this episode helps you in some way, shape, or form, uh, or you know what, if this one is more entertaining, uh, I suppose, because there's so few of us that are able to afford this card, this is literally just going to be one of those flexes where we're driving a Lamborghini and Ultimate Team, and that's exactly what this card is. Uh, but if you guys do enjoy the epis, drop a mad lad like on the video. If you guys are new to the channel, join the million subscribers and hit that subscribe button down below. So, uh, what do you get with a 92 rating Erling Braut Haaland that costs 2.6, uh, 2,650,000 coins. You get some nuts stats. 91 acceleration, 96 sprint speed. Attacking positioning with the marksman goes up to 99. Finishing goes up to 99. Shot power is already 99. Volleys goes to 99. Penalties goes to 99. So let me repeat. Every shooting stat other than long shots goes up to 99 with the marksman chem style. Passing we're not too concerned about. 99 short passing, 99 curve. That's absolutely ridiculous. Uh, we're going to use the marksman again, like I said, to uh, jack off a little bit of that dribbling. 97 composure. 95 dribbling, 97 ball control, 95 reactions, and then the agility goes up to 87, and then we've got 99 strength with 99 aggression. So what we're going to do in-game is we're going to switch to the 4-2-2 uh, tactic, which is just literally all it's going to do, it's going to swap uh, Erling and Dani Olmo, and I think that's where Dani Olmo's best served. He's best served as a cam lamb or ram because he's right foot, uh, because he's got the weak foot, uh, and then we're going to play Erling Brad Holland, in my opinion, best served as a left striker, shooting crossbody with that left uh, with that left foot. That's where I've had success with him and uh, we're gonna get into a couple matches here we got Delaney we got McKinney we absolutely bossed out yesterday in our matches let's see if we can keep some of that luck up let's see if the Norwegian mad lad lives up to the hype let's see if he's maybe I don't know he's gonna have to do some bits but let's see if he comes close to justifying that 2.6 million coin price tag <laughs> Okay. Again, I would I, I would expect easily to score a goal like that with Erling. Like that should be an easy, easy goal to score. First goal, you guys know the routine. You guys know the tradition on the channel. Every day that we score a goal with the dude, he absolutely who is that? Is that Kara? He sends him to the shop. <laughs> Halla, och så står det till. Har du sett att i det sista har du gått där vill? Erling Harald med en rispa. 
gutta kan dock slutta å prate så mye Da ble det ikke noe løye Fra en hel av om verdenskrise Herregud! Ok So, here's, he's probably gonna rate, yeah, he's getting out of here It's 144 total in game stat upgrade This was just a simple through ball from Erling Braut Haaland Literally just made his defender disappear I, this, is, this is the one I really want to focus on because this is the difference This is the Erling Braut Haaland difference the fact that he's got the strength that he has, the fact that he has the height that he has, and that he's able to do it, very reminiscent of the Fanta Yusuf Polson, if you guys would remember that card from last year. And then check this out. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> In the frozen tundra of Norway. Die. Gutta kan dock slutta å prate så mye Da ble det ikke noe løye Erling, hva er det? Bro, denne kartet... Denne kartet er absolutt broken Denne kartet er faktisk broken Du så hans defender prøve å bøde opp Erling Og det er literally... Utenfor kanskje Virgil van Dijk, jeg vet ikke hvem det var Den pære søl Literally, han er en fot kjortere enn ham Og det ser ikke ut som han er nær... Det ser ikke ut som han er nær den strengt Erling literally just pushed him aside, yeah, he shoved him aside, and whoever that defender was just absolutely stood zero chance. Timo Werner. Kai Havertz. Oof. Keep, keeper almost got there. Or keeper did get there, we almost got there. Bro, he's okay. Guys, I was about to say chat. Guys, he's he's different. Nine times out of ten, even like a really good striker, um, from time to time will get bodied out in that situation. Erling is so strong. His combination of speed and strength. Again, I'm not going to say he's going to come anywhere close to justifying a 2.6 million coin price tag. But if you get a guy that scores like nine times out of ten, where you have to like not worry at all, it, does that justify? If that had gone in, I would have said he would have been worth three million. <laughs> Erling, you absolute freaking lad. In the fjords of nowhere, a boy was born. This is what I think about. When I see mountains in the stadium, I think of like ways to narrate the intro. In the fjords of Norway. A young boy was born, raised on Swedish fish and stir strumming. When he was 14, he started drinking McCoffees, and this McCoffee gave him the strength of a thousand Nordic gods. There we go, hey, there we go, Alfonso Davies. See, with the 4 4 2 sometimes. I just like running in a straight line and like dragging his players out of position. Yo Delaney. Yo Delaney's actually a really good shout. Super, super agile on the ball. Is it Omo? Go on! Go on! Finish him! Finish him! Come on, Daddy Omo! That is what you get for under 200,000 coins. A dribbling math lad. Danny Olmo, we, can, we can't come anywhere close to affording Erling Braut Haaland, but Danny Olmo is a guy that we can wrap our head around on the RTG. Come on, boys. What a finish. The Haaland Hattie. Want to know what's great about Haaland? He's not selfish. Timo. He might be riding the pine this week in Weekend League, boys. That was very tough to see. Yikes, and it leads directly to that. Well, I mean, we're, look, we're not at risk of losing the game, but Jesus. Another game where Erling Haaland, I mean, like, look what he did. Whose life did he end? Don't tell me that was Ronald Koeman. He ended Ronald Koeman's life. He's like, please, don't embarrass me, Erling. I can't believe you've done this. Salah saldrá con Madrid en la mitad de la cancha y la amenaza para el arco rival descansa en esa dupla ofensiva. Ojo con yo. Damn, Alba. GG. All right, so this is the game where we put Erling to the test. 
We put 92 Erling versus arguably any version of his card is basically the best uh, best defender in the game. Erling versus Virgil van Dijk. Look at that battle. Look at that ferocious battle. My name is Sway Grills, and today I'm going to teach you how to stay alive in the wilderness. If you come across a dead snake, pee in it. Then tie the end of the snake and use that as a water bottle. You can drink your own pee for up to five days. It could save your life. <laughs> that's why he's the best defender in the game. Come on! That's why! Come on, boys. Who would have thought? Who would have thought? It wasn't the 2.6 million coin player that got the best of DVD. It was the 185,000 coin future stars, Dani Olmo, a.k.a. the Croatian Spaniard. Timo Werner. DVD takes another dub. Danny! Danny Olmo! Bro, you can't even, you can't script it! Come on! Erling! For the love of God! In a match where I was expecting to take a loss, I'll take that. Hey, I will take that. Dani almost the Croatian Spaniard mad lad, goes ahead and bangs in two goals that equalizes versus, versus a very, very good opponent. As you guys can see, there are 6.7 for my main man Erling, Erling uh, and then 9.3 for Dani Olmo. So Erling shined in the first two, absolutely dominated, and then when we came up against VVD, uh, I guess he absorbed a little bit of that impact and allowed Dani Olmo and Timo Werner on the other side to do some work. So you could make the argument that even though he didn't score a whole lot of goals, he had an impact on the pitch in the form of absorbing the, uh, the VVD attention. But uh, per usual, boys, you guys know I like to give a little bit of a rating. Um, I, I, I'll I tell you one thing. I'm going to give it a thumbs up in terms of how this card feels as a special card. There's something... This this card feels incredibly and much better than his 86 rated inform. I'm very familiar with it. I took it through 20 games of Weekend League. The 86 inform lacks a little bit. It was very, very good for me, but lacks a little bit. In terms of on-the-pitch performance, I am going to have to go ahead and give it three out, three and a half out of five just because he left... Little bit of a sour taste was near, was a near perfect episodia, um, but just left a little bit of a sour taste in my mouth uh, towards the end there by hitting that post. But I mean, again, that's FIFA. Is that the patch? Is that Erling Brown Holland? Would I have hit the post with another player? Who's to say? I don't know. But uh, I will give it a thumbs up in terms of uh, in terms of uh, beast rating, in terms of how nuts this card actually feels on the pitch. So uh, put him through three games. Danny Olmo, again, very, very happy to see da Danny Olmo doing what he does. And uh, yeah, boys, that is going to do it for the future stars. Almost thought I wasn't going to be able to do this episode because I wasn't able to afford him, but 92 future stars Erling Braut Holland episode is in the books. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed, like I said, Boris. Uh, going to be doing a stream later tonight. Going to unlock that Nicolo Zagnolo. Going to do that as tomorrow's uh, upload. Um, so uh, meet me in the stream if you guys want to see so one unlock the objective we'll probably do a couple of drafts as well but anyway my bros hopefully you guys have enjoyed drop a like on the video if you did if you guys are new to the channel hit that subscribe button down below i will catch you guys for another upload tomorrow to next time my bros choose later adeh